the Republic of the Philippines is getting a real bargain. In this age of $1. 3 billion guided missile destroyers. The island nation is buying a used warship from South Korea for the bargain basement price of just $100. While that sounds like a screaming deal, exactly what is it getting for its money? The Philippines is in the midst of a defense buildup. The island country has been locked in a political face-off with China over competing territorial claims in the South China Sea, with no end in sight. The concern is the political dispute will escalate to a military one, a hypothetical conflict the Philippines would be woefully unready for. The country has been fighting an insurgency against various internal groups, including the Al-Qaeda-aligned Abu Sayyaf guerrilla force funding its army at the expense of its navy and air force. The country has been on a low-grade shopping binge, purchasing a dozen F-A-50 fighters from South Korea and accepting donated Coast Guard cutters from the United States. Now, according to the Jakarta Post, it is about to get a po one class Corvette from South Korea for the fantastic sum of $100. The ship Rock chung was decommissioned from the Republic of Korea Navy in December 2016. The purchase is actually a transfer, and the $100 is largely symbolic. The Poam class corvettes were some of the first large warships built by South Korean shipyards. 24 corvettes were built during the mid-1980s and early 1990s between 1984 and 1993. Each weighed 1. 200 tons fully loaded and had a maximum speed of 32 knots. Armed with a pair of Italian-made 76mm deck guns four Harpoon anti-ship missiles, two 40mm cannons and anti-submarine torpedoes as well as depth charges. The Poam class ships were built mainly to patrol South Korean coastal waters and square off against North Korea's fleet of small gunboats and coastal submarines.